Welcome back everyone. So MySQL table can become corrupted, meaning that an error has occurred and the data held within them is unreadable. So attempt to read from a corrupted table will usually lead to the server crashing. And so in this video, I will be sharing the best and the simplest way to fix and repair MySQL table. So without any delay, let's quickly get started. So on my end, you can see I have my SQL corrupted file in this zip file. So this is what I will be fixing right now. So what you have to do, you will be getting the link in the description. You will have to copy that link and paste into your browser. And you will be coming to this website of Stellar SQL database repair tool. This is a very powerful tool and you can read about it. So these are the features that are included in this software that will be helping you. So once you come up here, you will have to click on free download. And the file will be quickly downloaded click on the downloaded file click on yes and this kind of setup page will be up now here you have to click on next next here if you want to change the installation location then you can change from here i will keep it as it is then you have to click on next 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 and install and it will be quickly installed so you will have to click on finish click on yes and this kind of a stellar repair for MySQL dashboard will be up and it's really very easy to operate. You just have to click here on browse and then you need to locate to the place where you have the corrupted MySQL table. On my end, it's on the download section. So I will click on download, then I will select MySQL table corrupted file. Then I have to click on OK and click on OK again. So now it will show me all the database list and I have to make sure that all of them are being checked. And then finally, I have to click on repair and just take a few seconds only. And you can see it says selected database repaired successfully. So once it's been done, now you can click on OK and you can view the file from the left hand side. You can click on the table section and you can view all the file over here. And you can see that all of them are being repaired now. OK, so once it's been repaired now, in order to save it, you will have to click on the save option that is on the left hand top. So click on it and now it will ask you to enter the activation key to activate the product. So fixing the MySQL table will be absolutely free. But if you want to save it, then you will have to go with a paid license. So you can come to their website and here you can check their pricing. That is $199 for one year license and the toolkit is for $499. Of course, you can go with the technician plan that is $199 valid for one year. And additionally, if you have any kind of question or you need any kind of discount or any kind of problem, then you can call on this number. They also provide you 30 day of money back guarantee in case if it doesn't work for you. And you can also have a look here on the Trustpilot review. They got 46 review of five star rating. OK, so just go ahead and purchase the plan. Once you get the key, you will have to enter the key over here and then you have to click on activate. And then you will be getting a message activation completed successfully. So now you are good to go and just save the file. So click on OK again. Again, click on the save option at the left and top. Now it asks you save as and give you a few different options like MySQL, HTML, CSV, XLS or SQL script. So whichever option you want to choose, you can choose from here. So I will be going with the SQL script. I will select the SQL script option. And then it will show me the destination path that where exactly this MySQL table will be saved. And then finally, I have to click on save. And it will take about a minute now to save the file successfully. So kindly wait until it's all been done. And once it will be done, it says saving process completed. So click on OK. And now it will automatically bring up the table that has been fixed. And here you can view the file. You can click on it and you will find all the table in the script here. So you can check it out. OK, so this is how exactly this work, guys. It's very simple and works 100 percent. I have already tested on multiple corrupted MySQL table and it works for them very smoothly. So that's all, guys, for today. Hopefully you found this information useful. If yes, do not forget to like and subscribe. If you have any question, you can let me know in the comment section. Till then, take care. Bye bye.